that happens is going to create a little bit more of a uh, ripple effect. You can try to simulate growth, or you can just, in action, which is what my family does when we have a problem, you just kind of don't talk about it, and eventually it goes away. <laughs> well, it is a bigger issue than what the Stevens Thanksgiving dinner problems are. But it's probably a combination of all of those things that they need to figure out. And, and the one thing that we say is Europe is a scenario that is going to take a decade to figure out. So if you expect all of a sudden next year, they're going to have the answer, and everyone's going to be happy and sitting around the table, it's not, it's not going to be the case. So Europe's going to be in headlines for about a minute. But well, we think they're going to figure it out. Uh, the United States. What's, what's happening in the United States? A lot. But um, here's a few data points that maybe put some perspective on where we're at. On the left, you see where our growth is coming from and where it's not coming from. Since 2009, we've seen a lot of growth coming from the private sector, from people like you. In fact, that growth rate is 3.3%. That's, that's actually pretty close to long-term averages. 